methodical search by multiple law enforcement agencies from across the state of Michigan. Police going building by building as 911 calls pour in from concerned students and people who live on that campus. Tonight, we're getting new video into the news. We want to share it with you. Witnesses describe seeing these police cars flying down highways to get to campus. Lights flashing as first responders head toward reports of shots fired. There's another video on campus. Students watched as armed officers went building to building, searching for a suspect and telling others to shelter in place. We've also seen video of students who have been rescued. Here they are. Police slowly getting them to safety as this active search continues. Tonight, the ABC 7 I team says the Justice Department has been put on alert that there are multiple gunshot victims on the main campus. The gunman believed to be armed with a rifle and is still not in custody. And just a short time ago, we spoke to Michigan State student Quinn Parks, who's from Evanston. Let's listen. At 8.30, about five police cars just zoomed by my window and I thought maybe there was something minor going on, but then uh, shortly after police cars from around the state started going towards my window uh, and it's just been, it's been absolutely crazy. So it's been about an hour and a half now. Quinn still sheltered in his place right now. Michigan Governor Gretchen Whitmer tweeting this. I've been briefed on the shooting at Michigan State University. The Michigan State Police, along with Michigan Public Safety, local law enforcement and first responders are on the ground. Let's wrap our arms around the Spartan community tonight. We will keep everyone updated as we learn more. We're expecting a news conference from police tonight. And if that happens during this newscast, we'll try to bring it to you live. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.